hey what's going on busy bees welcome back to my channel just wanted to stop by we had an amazing memorial day weekend um it was also my husband's birthday so we were super super busy he had an extra day also ran over to this tuesday but everything was wonderful like i said we were super busy um but it's okay we got a lot of things that we set out to get accomplished accomplished and um well what can i say just sit back and watch so i just came in from um walking my babies my fur babies i love that little thing on uh tiktok or um I don't know. It just goes, that's just my baby doggies. That's just my baby doggies. I actually did a, did I do a TikTok with that? <sighs> a reel on Facebook. I did it. So I'm making a small pot of coffee because everybody doesn't drink it here. But I do. And I love this coffee. So, um, it's Saturday morning. one of my favorite cups. My girlfriend had brought me a cup last year and it was about two years ago and I, I, I said it before, I'm a creature of habit, so I usually use the same thing over and over again. And um, yeah, so this is my cup that I have my morning coffee in and I do a little Bible study. And usually I don't do too much Bible study on Saturday morning, I might do like a devotional. But I didn't study the way I really like to yesterday. So this morning I'm going to dive back into some Ephesians 5. Um, I wasn't there yesterday, but yesterday I was reading. What was I reading yesterday? Oh, I was reading. Um, it's this book called, um, what is it? The God's Plan for Man. Excellent, excellent book. I was reading that in the part that I was reading. You're supposed to read it chronologically, but... So you're supposed to read it from front to back, and it's in order to help you um, understand God's plan for man. But what I did is because where I'm at right now, specifically in life, I just went to the faith topic, and I'm just laying in that. I'm sitting at the Father's feet, praying um, for understanding even the more, you know. I'm just right there, you know. So, with that being said, um, this morning I just want to go into some Ephesians 5, uh, just talking about being married and the example of um, the marriage. You know, the marriage was an example of the uh, church with the Lord. So, I want to go and um, just delve into that this morning and just let the Lord saturate my mind. Plus, my husband and I have a YouTube channel called Marriage Data. So we, I, I feel led to go into there because God is probably giving me some information. I don't know for sure, but probably going to give me some information for a next um, Marriage Data episode. So, yeah, God is amazing. He really is. And I've shared, maybe I didn't share on this channel our testimony, but he's just good. He has kept me and my husband together for uh, 27 years. We were married 27 years, and it's nothing but the grace of God. Nothing but the grace of God. So, um, yeah, I got up this morning, brushed my teeth, washed my face, just threw on some jeans so I could take the dogs out for a walk. And would you believe I got out there and they act like they didn't want to go. Help me, Jesus. So my daughter must have got in from work about 1 o'clock and took them out. So this is just my morning routine. I get up early and um, just start my day. Start my day with the Lord first, you know. So I read. I listen to some devotionals as I'm brushing my teeth, washing my face. Or I'm just totally quiet. Totally quiet. You know, it's funny. I'm starting to meditate, and the meditation is a, it's called Christian guided meditation. And they'll do a scripture, and then say some words about the scripture. So I'm doing that still, but I'm doing the meditation on my own 
you know, muttering the words of I'm saying the Lord is my shepherd. I'm going to get in a quiet place, do some grounding exercises to calm myself, do some breathing. Inhale in, exhale out, get the scripture in my mind, and I'm going to focus on that scripture. So say for instance, Psalms 23, the Lord is my shepherd. So I'm inhaling and I'm exhaling and I'm, the Lord is my shepherd. I might mutter it just a little bit, mean, meaning to mumble quietly. And as I'm doing that, and I do close my eyes. Sometimes I leave my eyes open because when I close my eyes, I start seeing pictures and visions. And sometimes the pictures and visions are not about that scripture, okay? Ooh. So I, when I notice that I'm being distracted like that, I'll open my eyes. And then I start to uh, go back to the visualization, go back to the uh, meditation. And then I'm doing the scripture, the Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want in hell. Exhale. What does that mean exactly? And then I begin to think about the attributes of the shepherd. He's a provider. He's a protector. He's a keeper. Sometimes I even visualize being a sheep. And him with the, I forget what you call the, oh my Lord, the thing, the staff. It's not actually a staff though, but I visualize him, you know, pulling me back in line and just loving on me, you know. So stuff like that. Um, yeah. So I hope you all have a wonderful, wonderful weekend. I am going to go. I'm going to get ready to have my coffee and do my Bible study, but I just want to say, take time for the Lord. If you don't know him, ask him to draw draw you to him. Just a sincere, quiet prayer. God, please draw me near you. Help me to understand you. I encourage you. He will send someone to you that will help you along the way. He's just good like that, you know. So I hope you all have a wonderful weekend. I will be praying for all the busy bees up in here, up in here. And um, hit like and subscribe. Please leave a comment. And also um, check out my other uh, YouTube channels if you have time, if you just chilling and wanna do a little something. We have uh, Mama is Busy. That's us right now. <laughs> no, we have um, Marriage Data. So check that out. That's a YouTube channel with me and my husband. We speak to ma people that are married and people that who are desiring to be married. You know. So, again, I pray you all have a wonderful weekend. What up, Dizzy Bees? I just wanted to let y'all know, look at my husband, first thing in the morning, up cooking breakfast for us. <laughs> and, and the crazy thing is, it's his day off. Look at God, I'm telling you. When God bless you, he blesses you. And as always, I just want to say thank you for visiting me. And I hope my little weekend vibe was a vibe for you. Have a wonderful week. God bless.